Yeah, we did, Jared. I would say that it didn't really seem very Christmassy out in this location, though. But in the last hour, we have had heavy wind, then we had heavy hail, then we had heavy rain, and now it's just kind of calm out here in North Phoenix, although I'm still keeping my hood on because I don't have any hair. But there has been a little bit of accumulation that has started to form here on the northbound on-ramp on the Greenway exit here in North Phoenix getting on to I-17. You can see the water starting to flow down the sidewalk, the crosswalk over there. Nothing that's been two major cars have still been continuing to go through, but you can see some of the impacts of this past hour. Also been some loud thunder, the occasional lightning strike. But as I mentioned, that one constant, it has been the wind. If you take a look at some of that hail video I tweeted about right after our live shot at the top of the 8 o'clock news, Look at this. The hail, it's pretty much going sideways. The plants here at the La Quinta off of Greenway and I-17, they're swaying in all different directions. And if you can avoid it, stay off the roads. The visibility still not great right now. Some of those road closures that are currently happening in our state, I-40 westbound at milepost 252. I-17 northbound from State Routes 179 to Flagstaff, State Route 89A in both directions, and US-180 outside of Flagstaff between mileposts 240, 236 and 248. I also want to say that there are a couple of power outages happening in our state right now. Multiple outages, according to APS, in the Prescott area impacting over 3,000 people, as well as multiple outages here in the Phoenix area impacting over 3,000 people as well. For the latest weather conditions, as we mentioned before, keep it on the First Alert Weather Facebook page and and app as well as our AZ Family News app will keep you updated throughout the night. But for now, guys, I'm going to send it back to you.